Good afternoon ladies and gentlemen and welcome to our last notices of the first term. We've actually got there. Well done. Give yourselves a pat on the back. Um, the sun's shining. We've got two weeks of rest. If you're in key stage three, I hope you have a lovely break. If you're a GCSE or A-level student, you can have a little bit of a break, but you've still got to crack on with that work, all right? It's really important to keep your revision notes going, consolidate all of that learning. Um, so have a little break, but, but let's not do nothing, all right? And hopefully your teachers take some prep. Um, I've got Mr. Hardy with me, who's got some really important notices regarding Nations Day. Yes, hello everyone. I'm going to read because um, I want to get this right. Um, but thanks ever so much to everyone for um, volunteering to be part of Nations Day and filling in the form, which is on Friday the 29th of November. So that's the date for your diary, Friday the 29th of November. Um, we had an amazing response. Um, uh, in the past, we have um, put out the uh, list on, in Dixit, but we've realised that that's possibly a little bit GDPR not mm. compliant so um so uh what's going to happen is miss smith uh the heads pa is kindly gonna email the students during the holidays to let them know if you are on any store get or off a, the grass um if you are a stall holder or flag bearer um but if you are desperate to know you can ask your tutor this afternoon and they have got the list so they can tell you whether you are on it um if you are a flag bearer um, you don't need to provide your own flag. We will do that. We'll buy those for you. If you are a stall hold leader, you need to um, uh, work out and coordinate your stall, what to bring, food, drinks, games, quizzes. And you can't use the parade flags as your flag, so you need to bring your own flag for the stall. Um, if you're on a stall, talk to your stall leader. Um, and if you didn't make the list, I'm sorry about that. We couldn't take everybody. Um, but you can still get involved in Nations Day. Um, amazing stuff. Wear national dress. Um, eat lots of great food and participate in the fantastic part of the day. And there'll be more details coming out when it approaches. I've got one more notice. Oh, sir, my arms are hurting. Hang on. Sorry. One more notice. Um, World Scholars Cup. Um, loads of people have been asking. We've been having emails from your parents, carers. 2025 edition. I know we haven't gone to Yale yet, but the 2025 edition, a letter will be coming out first day of next half term with all the details. Um, uh, there's an information evening and online and all of that kind of stuff. If you want to know about World Scholars Cup, rumour is it's going to be to Bangkok next year. Um, come and speak to me almost quickly and we'll tell you more about it. Oh, well done, Mr. Hardy. Right, I, I don't want to speak, take up too, more, too much more time, but if you are a, in a tutor group where you haven't picked your co-curricular options and you're a tutor in a room with a tutor group that haven't done their co-curricular options, you are going to turn this off. We are three minutes into the notices, so you've still got five minutes in tutor. Have a little check of those um, spreadsheet from Miss Lunny, get your options picked because it, do, you know, it does help her to get it all organised and the registers done. So um, that's all from me. I hope you all have a wonderful half time. Um, please don't leave stuff in your lockers and bags laying around because everything will just get wrecked. So um, yes, have a lovely break. See you all later and we'll see you in November.